Well, hello, ma'am. Mike Huckabee for president. We spoke on the phone. Mike Huckabee? That's right. You're that Mormon candidate, no, don't you? No, 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 no. That's Mitt Romney. I am not a Mormon. No, ma'am. I, uh, Mike Huckabee for president. I told you I'd bring Jesus to Brittany. You brought Jesus? Well, he's not actually here. He's, he's in this book. He's in my heart. And if you let me in, I'll explain more. All right? Uh, I, I guess so. I can't get any worse. You know, we had Dr. Phil here. He tried all this, like, medication and stuff, but she built up a tolerance to it. You know, when a Valium doesn't work, and Clonopin didn't work, uh, and Xanax, they had our heroin and it didn't even work. You know what? Kyla knows what's going on. She's oh, still drinking. Calm, calm down. I can't calm, calm down. Calm down. Now, listen, you tried all the drugs. You put that into her body, right? And she did it on her own as well. None of it worked. You need to put Jesus into her soul, and that's what Mike Huckabee for president is here to do. Mr. Huckabee, why does this always happen to the Spears family? I, 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 I'm not sure. I think that the point is to make us despair so that we'll question if God loves us, and he does. Well, he's got a funny way of showing it. Oh my God. Don't cry, Mama. You're scaring me, Brittany. Oh my God. When are they gonna give me my babies back? Don't worry. We're gonna fix it, Brittany. How, Mama? How? You're gonna get Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> Who's gonna put the Jesus in me, Mama? Governor Huckabee, your presidential candidate, he's here. He's here he's to here. save you, Brittany. He's here to save you. You're gonna be on the campaign stump with him. I love stumps, Mama. I'm going to get him. All right. Britney Spears, I am presidential candidate Mike Huckabee. Got it. All right. Now listen, Brittany, your mother called me here. I understand that you've lived an abhorrent, unnatural, and sinful lifestyle, and I just want you to know if you let Jesus into your heart, those things will change. Ooh, when your son was 17, he killed a dog! And as governor, you oh, covered it up! Oh my god! Oh. Brittany, this is a governor! You can't talk to him like that! Oh. That's all right. That's all right. Oh. That's all right. Now listen to me, Brittany. Brittany, if you let Jesus Christ into your heart, everything will be forgiven. The drug abuse, the child abuse, That's true, the sir. comeback. It'll yes. all be forgiven, Brittany. It'll all be forgiven. Oh, yes. The only thing, it's too bad that in 1992, you said AIDS patients should be isolated from the general public. Uh, oh, give me more. Uh, give me more. That's all right, Mama. Mama. I'm so sorry. I can't understand a word you're saying. She's speaking in tongues. I need to talk to you, Mama. Oh, my God. Yeah. I need to talk to you, Mama. Brittany. Uh, <laughs> Uh, well, uh, uh, things have gotten a little bit out of hand. I wasn't uh, prepared for what I was about to see in there. Yeah, uh, well, this is drastic. We're going to have to take drastic measures. We're going to have to perform an exorcism. <laughs> Martini? Who the hell gave her an apple martini? Give me more candy! <laughs> you get out of there! Ah! One, two, three, four, five, six, six, six! One, two, three, four, five, six, six, six! That's how many male nurses I worked when I was at the hospital! <laughs> the power of Christ compelled you! Oh, oh you look better as a fat guy! Oh. You look like a fat guy! Oh. The power of Christ compels you! The power of Christ that compels you! The power of Christ that compels you! The, uh, the, 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 the power of public opinion comp compels you! 
power of God compels you. Where are you going? It's the power of uh, e entertainment that compels you. The power of TMZ compels you. R11 compels you! What is the name of the demon that dwells within? What is the name of the demon? What is your name, demon? It's Britney, bitch! <laughs> I command you to leave this servant of God. God? There is no God, only celebrity. People don't want to worship Jesus, they want to worship me. I am your God, your devil, and your Christ. Bow down to me or feel the wrath of Britney. Okay, that's a lot worse than I ever expected. I'm out of here. All right, I, I'm leaving here. I'm not coming back. I don't care if she goes on a campaign trail with me. As a matter of fact, tell her to endorse Obama. Sound good? You and that crazy bitch can stay by yourselves. <laughs> don't leave us here, please. <laughs> Get out of there, you devil! You give me back my baby! Oh, thank God, it's all. Oh, God, it smells like cheese in there. Oh, that's that stuff I wasn't even on board with. Not even Dr. Phil can handle that, and he's on my payroll! Oh, but it's over now. It's over now, finally. I can just go home.